Hello everybody, this is the Bulldozer, and thank you for giving me your time, and thank you for watching another one of my videos. First things first, YouTube is disabling people's comments as soon as they upload a video. And I want to thank a YouTuber out there, and I'm actually going to send him a DM, because I'm going to be playing this message um, in front of the rest of my videos, because all my comments from last week was disabled, and every video I uploaded for week two challenges. Not not week one, but week two. And then the two videos I uploaded today, those comments were also disabled. And a fellow YouTuber that I've been watching for a long time helped me fix this issue. And I'm probably going to be doing a video on this later. I'll make sure he doesn't do one first because um, he helped me with the problem. But I'm, I'm going to DM him and uh, first um, find out if he wants me to mention his name. If he does, I will pin a comment at the top of this video. Because it's absolutely insane. There, there is no chat in my videos. There is no children in my videos. And they're disabling the video's comments right away as soon as you upload them. But there is a fix for that. If you have any problems, leave me a comment down below. And I will certainly help you out. Number two was that we had tornado watches in my area yesterday. So I was unable to upload anything but the two videos I got uploaded and because I was working on the challenges or the comments on those I still I, I'm, I'm, after this video is put together I'm gonna have to go release those videos so I mean it's three o'clock in the morning now and I'm finally putting these videos together because the weather here was absolutely insane I mean tornado watches and the last thing is something I'm gonna start doing as of week three is I'm going to in the description list every one of the challenges the challenge will be listed there with a number and a link for that video so if you're looking for a challenge and you're watching one of my videos starting from week three on you don't have to go no further than the description area and you can find it right there you don't have to worry about searching for it if I put a video up on it it'll be marked down below this is something I'm going to do to help you, the viewer, to help you find videos faster that you're looking for. The other thing is uh, stage challenges, like uh, challenges one and two for this week. Those challenges will have timestamps in the video. So if you're looking for a particular thing in a particular stage of that challenge, you can go right to that. You don't have to watch the entire video. You can go right to that stage that you're looking for. Again, sorry for all this, but a lot of stuff has happened in the last few hours. So, again, I apologize. But, again, if you're having your your comments disabled on your videos, leave me a comment down below and I'll be sure to help you. Now, this video here is going to have two challenges in it. It's going to have challenge number six and challenge number seven of the Battle Pass challenges, which means you need to have the Battle Pass unlocked in order to do this. And everybody should have the Battle Pass unlocked, especially if you have or had season seven because they gave you an opportunity to get a free season eight battle pass by completing overtime challenges so challenge number six is deal headshot damage to opponents now you need a score of 500 and don't forget if you need information for the challenge number seven which is get eliminations with an SMG a pistol and a sniper rifle the timestamp for that part of the video is in the description first off let's go ahead and do challenge number six dealing headshot damage to opponents now you're gonna see I kinda had a rough time at searching stuff all I got is double pistols and a shotgun so what I'll try to do is I'll try to take out this guy's or this girl's platform the opponent let me put it that way and that doesn't work they move back so then I'm starting to do some more damage underneath they start building out so I make my way underneath their platform one of the things I love to do in Fortnite is use people's builds against them this person has no clue where I'm at they know I'm somewhere close by so I'm using the Sun if you can see the shadow you can see them drop down look they dropped down didn't even know I was there so I got a shot on them Missed the second shot. I'm going to hit the third shot. Then he's going to build out on me. Hit the fourth shot. And I'm going to jump up and tag him. Kill them and get my first headshot damage. Which was, I think, like 54 or something like that. 
Then I catch this person here drinking a large shield, so I tag them right in the head as soon as they drop their hands. So that's going to give me a total of 265 now out of the 500, just over halfway down. Done, that is. So now we're going to move across, get up on the hill here. I've got the purple heavy sniper rifle. I'm going to look around. Got a lot of movement. I don't want to give my position, so I'm going to, you know, be really patient. And patient pays off. I catch this person coming in. They're going to land in this build right here, and they're going to poke up just enough where I can raise my sight and pop them for 375. Which, it was blue, so I guess I always thought gold was headshot, but blue was 375. It looked like a headshot to me, but I will take it. Looking at the current challenge progress, to confirm yes, I got 500 of 500. So now we're going to move on to challenge number seven, and that is get an elimination with an SMG, a pistol, and a sniper rifle. This does not have to be in one game. You can do this in multiple games, but if you're able to do it in one game, that much better. Now, I actually had something crazy happen during this. It allowed me to get a freebie from the Fortnite gods. You can see this person right here. You saw this clip earlier where I popped them for the headshot. That is my sniper rifle kill. Now, take a look at this, folks. I am on the mountaintop looking around for somebody and get shot from above. I'm going to turn around with my SMG and put shots in them, but I do not kill them. Look, I still have a 1 on my screen, but it gives me credit for the elimination. So, um, to me, that was an assist. Here, let's look at it again in slow motion. You can see... I'm popping him, I'm getting all kinds of points, but I do not get the kill. My teammate gets the kill. I still have a one on my screen for kills, but yet it gave me progress on that challenge. Thank you, Fortnite Gods. Here is our last one. We're going down to do the pistol elimination now. See this person down here? They have no clue that I'm even there. They should have heard me coming in. But I'm going to pop them, and that is going to complete this challenge. So there we have it. That's challenges 6, deal the headshot damage, and challenge 7, get the eliminations with the SMG, the pistols, and the sniper rifles. Don't forget, if you need to find out any other information for any of the challenges in week 3, starting this week, you'll find all of my videos in the description. There'll be a black circle telling you the name of that challenge, and there'll be a red circle with the link. The link will take you to that video. Also, all the stage challenges. Each stage will have its own timestamp. You will find it in that video for each and every stage to help you progress through that video if you only need a certain stage to complete. If you found this video helpful, please hit that like button, subscribe to the channel for more content, and if you subscribe, smash the notification bell so you know when I will upload my next video. Again, thank you for giving me your time, thank you for watching, I really do appreciate it. This is the Bulldozer, get your killing on, and I'm out of here.